with Falcon hockey coach Joe Cranston and Joe last weekend in the NCHA O'Brien Cup playoffs here at Hunterina, the Falcons beat eight Concordia five to two in a semifinal game, but then lost in the finals four to three in overtime to Adrian. Could you talk a little bit more about those two games? Um, well, we knew those games were going to be difficult, and um, you know we played okay against Concordia, but uh, like I've said in the past here, we. You know, our second game against St. Norbert's two weekends ago, we played well. And really, that's, we haven't been playing that well lately. And it's just, um, you know, Concordia had 12 seniors on that team. And they came in here and just hats off to that team. And they, they just did a great job. And they battled. And, you know, we ended up getting a 5-2 to two win. And, and then going in the next day, we had a 3-0 three, three to nothing lead um, on Adrian. And, and they got a weird one, it bounced off two of our people into the net and it kind of got a momentum and and we just, we got uh, slowly lost momentum as that game uh, went on and on and, and uh, we went into the second or the third period with a two goal lead, that's the worst lead you want to have and I, I mean I'm thinking Adrian gets the next goal and they could win this thing and we came out and played like we were expecting to win and not like we had to, had to finish so that last 20 minutes cost us uh, the O'Brien Trophy, leaving our trophy case and going to Adrian, but hopefully that will motivate us next year just to, to even work harder and, and step up our program next year and work that much harder to get that thing back in our trophy case. Joe, looking ahead, uh, on Monday the Falcons got some great news. They earned one of two at-large bursts into this year's NCAA tournament. The second straight year, and I think the third year out of four that the Falcons have been in the national tournament. Um, River Falls will host Gustavus Adolphus on Friday here at Hunterina at 7.05 p.m. Earlier this year, the two teams played here at Hunterina, and the Falcons took a 4-2 win back in December. What are you looking for with this game? Uh, well, we're just so happy to be playing, number one, uh, third straight year in the NCAA tournament, which is big for us. And, and so as it turned out, losing that one game, um, if we'd have won that game, we'd be hosting Gustavus here on Friday night. If we lost, we ended up hosting him. So it didn't really affect us. It affected other teams in positive and negative ways. But, but we're just happy to be playing in March. And um, So Gustavus is a good team. They're always a good team. Uh, we did beat them by a goal plus an empty netter earlier in the year. But uh, we know how they play, and it should just be an awesome game because they play a lot of times you get into our league and it's physical and it's clutch and grab and it's just it's kind of a war and uh, I love playing the St. Thomas's and Gustavus's because those teams skate and it's just fun. So that's going to be a great game. Um, we're all looking forward to it. You just know we got to play three periods and then uh, <clears throat> get to that final four and you know and uh, keep uh, keep on track with uh, what our goal has been all year. Joe, uh, just for the fans, the tickets are on sale during regular, regular business hours here at Hunterina, and hopefully we can fill the place on, on Friday night. Joe, good luck. We'll talk to you next week.